All right, so today we are talking minimal fall outfits. And honestly, these outfits can even be transitioning into winter because the weather kind of skipped like fall and went right into the cold, cold temperatures. But we're here. And the first outfit that I came up with is this right here. It's so simple. Like I'm telling you, all of these outfits are very simple to put together, but they look so chic. So what I did right here is I'm wearing just a simple blue shirt. This is from Arquette, but you can find like a blue light blue shirt like this anywhere. And I just paired it with my Reformation jeans and pretty much that's the base layer. Now the trick right here is to, well, it's not even a trick. It's just like the way that I styled it, but I buttoned it up all the way up just to give it like that very nice like put together corporate kind of look and feel tucked it in because of course we have to bring back the waist because otherwise it's just like a shirt with a jeans right then i was like okay let me throw the balance off a little bit with my off-white heels these are from very old from zara and then i love to pair like blue with this camel color like the classic trench color so put on this trench coat and just for some texture and some pattern i threw on this sweater and actually like previously i used to think what's the point of like throwing a sweater like this just on a like an outfit okay but now i've changed my mind <laughs> first of all it really adds to the outfit like it brings in an extra layer dimension like especially if your outfit is like very plain solid colors if you're feeling like something is missing try this trick right here just throw it on and also like 100 it keeps me warmer even just throwing it on like this but if i'm like very cold i can actually wear the sweater as well and then put the trench coat over it i've been loving styling like sweaters this way and that's pretty much it like i added my sunglasses for some you know if it's sunny but even sometimes if it's not sunny i'll put on my sunglasses during the day just because it adds something to an outfit and then i paired it the outfit with this handbag from Celine, just a beautiful fall color for sure i mean i wear this handbag all year round but it's sort of the most beautiful brown color for fall but yeah that's the outfit like super simple i'm sure that you have if not all of these pieces in your closet you have most of them and either way i'll link like whatever i'm wearing in the description also along with similars so if you're missing something you can shop it but i like all of these outfits that i'm showing you in this video the purpose is that you can recreate them with things that you already have in your closet so let's go to the second outfit here is another cute outfit super minimal but it's giving like honestly the best thing about fall is layering and i love to use like my creativity just to come up with ways that i haven't really worn my clothes yet and this is it right here this vest is something that i got actually for summer because the vest was all the thing all the rage during summer but this is like a way to wear it in the fall you know cooler months as well so vest is from massimo Dutti. this shirt is from the frankie shop and my leggings leather leggings are from abercrombie very old as well and my doc martens i dusted them off and just you know they are ready to be worn this fall winter season and yeah it's just my chanel handbag and ysl sunglasses and that's the look again super easy i'm sure that you have these pieces Maybe you don't have a vest, but you have to, you know, maybe find a good one that you can style. It's a very versatile piece. So I'm glad that I have it in my wardrobe right now. But yeah, I think that this play on the layering part, you know, even though the vest is blue and the legs are black, it doesn't matter. It still goes, it still works. Very cohesive and just love this one. Okay, this might be my favorite outfit, but I say that with a lot of outfits, so bear with me. But I love this blazer. Like this blazer from Frankie Shop is one of my best buys. So maybe you don't have this exact same blazer in your wardrobe, but I'm sure you have like an oversized blazer if you've been watching my channel. So you can definitely recreate this outfit with an oversized blazer. It doesn't really matter the color because 
the base layers are black so i have this black turtleneck from h&m black like you know a little bit of a washed kind of black jean from everlane my black loafers from isabel morant and i have some glittery socks from and other stories but you can do like just plain black socks as well and a celine belt from well belt from celine <laughs> but you can use any belt of course but the thing that i love about this outfit is that even if it's like getting very cold i can still like wear this i can wear like my thermal layer underneath this top i can wear thermal leggings underneath my pair of my jeans and even thermal socks if i want and i'll be like very warm and toasty and wear like the the blazer over it because this blazer is not like it's not wool or anything like that it's very thin blazer that you can wear all year round but if you add your layers to the outfit you can wear it a little bit longer into the colder months so usually for summer i roll up the sleeves of the blazer but for fall winter i just love the dramatization of you know big oversized sleeves i mean some people don't like that some people feel like they're drowning but i think it's like a very good balance between you know oversizedness around the sleeves and then i cinched it in with the with the belt so in my opinion it's a good balance so yeah let me know what you think in the comments about this outfit this outfit is for my corporate girlies i try to take that into account like every time i like make a video because i know the majority of you work at an office so and i mean i know some people work at home as well so i try to do like some lounge chair as well but i try to bring a good balance but this one is definitely for corporate girls like if you are going to the office it's like kind of dressed up this is a perfect outfit for that i mean except the bag of course but if you are going to a date night you can take this from the office to like a bar immediately i recently got this knit skirt and i was thinking how do i style this like this is like a little bit out of my comfort zone because usually i go for pants and jeans but i want to you know bring more variety to my wardrobe so i got this knit skirt and i was thinking of styling it with knee-high boots but i still I'm yet to find a good one that fits my big calves. So if you know of a good one, I think I already asked you this. I got some suggestions, but not keen on one yet. So I'm open for more suggestions. But in the meantime, I was thinking, okay, how do I style this? And then I, I was thinking, okay, let me just add my thermal leggings underneath the skirt. No one will know and just wear it with heels. So this is definitely something that I would wear like to a date night and, you know, throw my big trench coat over this or a big like wool coat and I'll be warm for sure. Even though my feet will be freezing, kind of, I'm still going to be warm. And, you know, especially if it's like just like, walking from the parking garage to a restaurant, definitely something that i can do and um, to be fair like when i used to work at a nicer office i used to wear my heels like pumps like this during the fall winter season and everyone was like asking me how do you do that aren't your feet cold but i don't know as long as like the top half of my body is warm i'm good so this is what i came up with the sweater and the skirt are from Cezanne. my heels are jimmy Choo, and this handbag is from dior so again super easy something to recreate and also an idea to style your skirts if you have them in your wardrobe all right if there is a mission that i have in my life is how can i be the most comfortable especially when it's cold like when it's hot i want to be you know a little bit sexy sophisticated cold i just want to be comfortable <laughs> and this is how you do it this is a fuzzy sweater that i got from walmart and in at the first glance i was like okay this is cute i can wear it at home lounging around you know walking the dog but this is how you wear it you know out and about as well i paired it with these flared leggings or pants from arrestus they don't look like leggings but they feel like leggings they look very put together you know with the seam on the center of the pant and they're just like the most comfortable material very thick material so you won't see anything through 
and very long so i'm wearing them right here with my chunky dr martens but if i wear them with heels they will look beautiful as well which i've done before so this is such a first style piece and it's slowly becoming one of my favorite pants lately but yeah this is like very comfortable outfit and again if you want to take it even into colder weather just wear your thermal layer underneath the sweater even underneath these pants you can do it because it's very tight fitting and it will be warm for sure so again very easy outfits to put together so i really hope you enjoyed this video that you got some inspiration and i love to show you like new things that are in store and i do love to buy new things to like fill in the gaps in my wardrobe but i also love like styling the new pieces that I got so you can see all the different ways that you can wear like very simple outfits but still look you know a little bit sophisticated put together cute like you have some sense of fashion and style so thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe if you're not yet we're on the road to 100k this year so if you're not subscribed just hit that subscribe button you know you're supporting a business right here so let's let's get to that one earth k i know we can do it so yeah i'll see you in my next one bye